Hey, you guys, I'm Mandy. This is Luca Red Tarot. Somebody is on this I'll die for you type stuff, okay? <laughs> That's crazy. Okay, six of wands at the bottom of the deck. And then the ten of wands, let's see. That might be significant, it might not be. But the song that I got for y'all before I started was Die For You, The Weekend. Okay, somebody could be walking away from temptation here with the devil coming out or walking away from a Capricorn, possibly. Hmm. King of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, energy. All right, what else? What else? What else? What else does the collective need to know right now? What do they need to know right now? Okay. Wow. The star Aquarius energy. Somebody really... Hmm, somebody's really healing here over a lot of things. The Queen of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Wow. Death at the bottom of the deck. Scorpio energy. Some of you guys, this is a passed over loved one um, trying to come through here. Uh, the Hangman, Pisces energy here. And the Three of Cups. Yeah, for some of y'all, I'm really feeling like you got a, a passed over loved one that's really watching over you and proud of you for resisting some kind of temptation. Y'all could have been uh, battling with addictions or something like that. The Page of Pentacles and the King of Cups. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Hmm. All right. Somebody's very proud of you. This person could be alive or on the other side. Judgment. Somebody is proud of you for letting something go here. Or some judgment call that you made. Strength at the bottom of the day. For having the strength. Wow. Hmm. I'm finding ways to articulate the feeling I'm going through. I just can't say I don't love you because I love you. Okay, that was that's some of the lyrics from that song. Somebody might love you, but they feel like, and I just seen 222 on the clock. They feel like, uh, well, I guess they're afraid. That's what it's coming through as. Hmm, all right. This person feels like you are a soulmate of theirs okay with the ace of swords coming through and the two of cups all right temperance all right sagittarius energy this person feels like you are some kind of earth angel possibly all right um justice with the seven of cups libra energy this person seems to be seems to be watching now this is giving me also watching you from above somebody is watching you from above okay definitely could be a leo oh <laughs> some of you guys have got a few choice yeah some of y'all have got a few choices here um in in like relationships and different areas of your life all right so with the death card at the bottom of the deck, Scorpio energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Hmm. It's like they're they're seeing one of these options as some kind of temptation here, okay? So what's up with that? Three of Cups. This could be somebody that you have a soul contract with. And I've seen the four of wands. Okay. The four of pentacles and the ten of swords here. Yeah, definitely feels like some of y'all could have been struggling with addiction. But um, some of y'all could be struggling with somebody not wanting to let you go here. Okay. The queen of wands at the bottom of the deck. Um, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. So this is a general reading. So there could be several different stories here. Um, I am seeing like we got we had a Queen and King of Wands, and then the King of Pentacles also showed up. The qu King and Queen of Pentacles. So this could be two people who are in relationships here. All right. 
um, some of y'all could be in some kind of karmic relationship here or have some kind of karmic contract that you are getting ready to close out, okay? Um, yeah, because it's, it's like, with the five of wands at the bottom of the deck, it's like it's messing up your energy, causing you, like, anxiety and the seven of swords. Um, seven of swords, you could be dealing with somebody who's been deceitful and you know yeah kind of dishonest uh right okay wow your guys have been trying to tell you this with this uh temperance card and the ace of pentacles sagittarius taurus virgo capricorn it's like yes <laughs> your guys have been like all five 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 on the clock um they're trying to warn you about someone here. They've been trying to warn you. This could be about a husband, okay? Who is like a wolf in sheep's clothing, a baby daddy or something, all right? Is what I'm getting. It's time to end this cycle and get the hell out of there. Is what I'm... Okay. The three of wands. They really want you to see this person for who they are. Okay, so... Let's get a few more. Um, okay, so show me who they need to be. <sighs> the person that you um, need to be aware of is this King of Pentacles. So this could be a baby daddy. This could be a husband, even a father for some of y'all. The Knight of Swords and the Five of Swords. Hmm. Eight of Pentacles at the bottom of the day. What in the world? All right, what else do they need to know? And I'm seeing this moon. This That's the sun, but it looks like the moon there. Like, there's some kind of... What is this? What do they need to know about this person? The Five of Wands and the Five of Swords. So, we got... I seen Five, Five, Five. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so for some of y'all... It's a father. Yeah. For some of y'all, there's a father coming through, okay, that's trying to warn you about something. You've been getting signs from your father or grandfather or something, okay? Um, could be a Sagittarius. Don't have to be. But the temperance card a lot of times represents like your, your angels and ancestors, your spirit guides trying to warn you about something. What is this? Two of Pentacles, that somebody, it could be that somebody is, hmm, let's just keep going. Somebody could be juggling, but I don't want to, yeah, somebody is definitely, it's like they got a lot of options, okay, they're entertaining other options, that don't necessarily mean that they're actually being intimate with other people, but they could be just watching other people online like liking their posts i don't know messaging them or something like that what else mm -hmm. that's what i'm see that's what i'm talking about the page of swords with the ace of cups it's like they're showing love to somebody out here online with the world card coming out okay cancer pisces scorpio gemini libra aquarius all right what else I'm seeing Leo here with the sun. And then Taurus, that bull there. All right. Um, also, um, Aquarius. Leo, what is that other sign? Of? Oh, Scorpio. All right. King of Swords with the Knight of Pentacles. Hmm. The Five of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. All right. Taurus energy. So... what <laughs> what is this what is this the devil wow so this person is basically codependent okay uh trying to keep you bound to them is what i'm getting for some of y'all there's different stories here but what i'm getting now is this could be like a narcissistic type person all right so i'm not up here like oh this person is a narcissist but this person wants you to be bound to them okay and why because of money Okay, 
the king of cups with the three of wands all right what what about the king of cups and the three of wands somebody is waiting nine of pentacles i just seen ten ten the ace of wands leo aries sagittarius cancer pisces scorpio somebody's waiting on somebody's waiting on you to get single it looks like somebody's waiting on you to get single this person feels like you're their soulmate um Ten of Pentacles with the Page of Wands. They could want to help you in some kind of way with money or something. You might hear from this person. This person feels like you are their wish fulfillment in some kind of way. Um, page of Pentacles. This could be a friend that's wanting to help you out. All right. They want to help you with something here with the Ace of Pentacles and the Magician. All right. They want to help you with something manifesting something or something like that so might be with a job you know somebody could be somebody could have a job coming in here a new job the knight of wands leo aries sagittarius yeah ace of swords at the bottom of the deck yeah somebody's wanting to help you with something here all right the fool coming out a new beginning um, the Knight of Cups at the bottom of the deck, that is like a romantic offer too. Y'all got a lot going on here. <laughs> okay. The Queen of Cups, the Six of Wands and the Chariot, something about a car or moving forward. Victory here, something about victory and success. Somebody wants to help you, um, be successful, victorious, Okay. Eight of Wands, you're gonna be hearing from somebody, it looks like, with the Eight of Wands, Sagittarius, Leo, Aries, Cancer, the Hierophant, Taurus. Somebody could be married. <laughs> somebody could be heartbroken. Okay, what else? The Eight of Swords, somebody is all up in their head. Somebody could be all up in their head about a legal situation as well. The Two of Wands, what's that? What else? The Eight of Pentacles. Somebody's, somebody's been working on something. They might have been working on getting out of a legal situation, a marriage, or something like that. Yeah. The Queen of Pentacles and the Ace of Swords. Somebody could be working on trying to get away from... Somebody could be trying to get out of a marriage. Somebody could be trying to get away from a... Yeah. Nine of Wands, like a karmic continuing cycle, okay. Uh, this could be a another narcissistic person. <laughs> okay, so I'm seeing like two people here both dealing with some kind of situation like that. Five of Cups, Scorpio energy. Um, It's like Page of Cups at the bottom of the deck. You or this person may have kids with whoever this other person is. Other people are, okay. Seven of Swords, the Eight of Cups, and the Four of Swords. So, the moon. <laughs> That's interesting and confusing. Because it's like, okay, the Seven of Swords. This Seven of Swords is giving me like sneaking off, trying to get away. The Four of Swords, uh, somebody feeling stuck. The moon, they're not voicing this. Okay, Justice, Libra Energy right they well they know it but they're not saying it is what i'm getting empress at the bottom of the deck okay four of pentacles this person will just this like a lot of times ten of wands this person is not wanting to let go so it's a difficult situation. It sounds like you guys, maybe more will come out in the next reading. I hope that helps in some kind of way or just entertain you in some kind of way. Y'all please like and subscribe. Thank you.